Hello, this is the 20th of December, Tuesday the 20th, and this is a picture of a deep space dredger. The deep space dredger trawls the galaxy, collecting junk that, well, it's basically a womble. It's something that I was quite nostalgic about. I was delighted to see it come back to game. I was so pleased. I remember when I used to play Ulit. Ulit was a moddable, fan-made version of Elite. It was based around the original Elite HUD, but it just looked nice. Well, I thought it looked nice, but I was wrong. It was great, though, because you had little missions you could load in, these, these little fan-made expansion packs. So you could have, like, I don't know, the Nova mission or the Terranus Corporation or the Deep Space Dredgers. You could load them in and then you'd find them scooping and, and you could um, dock on them and you had a little ship going. But in the new game, they've got a whole new fantastic sparkly quality to them. They also have kind of spooky stories connected to them, like the Phagos clan. These, uh, these dredger peoples are the wandering nomads of the galaxy who cut themselves off and keep themselves to themselves. And stories are told of them to small children at night about how the Phagos clan will get you and maybe eat you. And there's another clan who uh, helped out the pirate lord Archon Delane to synthesise a new form of drug called Onion Head Gamma Strain, the Blue Viper Club. And then, and then there was the clan that kicked off the new storyline. Really, it discovered a destroyed megaship, the Scrivener's Clan Dredger. They discovered the wreck of a ship called the Hesperus, and that led to the community doing lots of puzzles and findings out and uh, found another ship called the Adamaster and which eventually led to a big old goose chase to a place out near the witch head with a wrecked anaconda called the Proteus and a guy called Salvation and I guess the rest is history <laughs> anyway I shall see you tomorrow <laughs>